three nights of T-Swift completely sold out. Not a problem for some. They say they're still heading downtown just to catch a glimpse. So let's get to our Lydia Fielder. She is downtown right now. And Lydia, you talked to some people who are trying to get as close as they can without tickets. Yeah, Tracy Marius, that is right. But people who work for Nissan Stadium say if you don't have tickets, don't come to the stadium. Still, though, we heard from some fans who say even without a ticket, they're going to do whatever it takes to hear Taylor. When my sister beat cancer, we were like, we're getting to Taylor Swift by any means necessary. Rain or shine, we're going to be out here with her. While her sister drives eight hours from Pensacola, Taylor Swift superfan Brittany Myatt scopes out spots. Love her and midnights and folklore and evermore. On the downtown pedestrian bridge. Checking Ticketmaster and StubHub and everything every single day till I can find a reasonably priced ticket. And if not, I'm going to be right here. Without tickets to get inside, she and dozens of other fans we've heard from plan to bop along from the bridge. She's got all those screens and everything. It's going to be loud. I'm like, I'm sure there'll be more Swifties out here. I can sing, dance. This will be a perfect vantage point for that. The Titans VP of Marketing and Communications says the pedestrian bridge is not part of the stadium campus, so there won't be any stadium security there. And Metro Police says there will be officers on the bridge, but police say unless people are creating a problem, they can technically stay there. I'm not too worried about it. I think that PD is prepared for that. I mean, they've got to be with everything that's happening and all the popularity of it. If not, I'll just keep taking laps and I'll be able to hear it. So. That's fine with me. So when Myatt's sister gets to town, shake it off. <laughs> you shake it off. They plan to celebrate as cancer free Swifties. Hopefully we can get in. If not, we're going to be together. We're going to get to hug. We're going to get to love on each other and we're going to get to sing our favorite songs. So it's going to be great no matter where we're at. Now, we also heard of some fans hoping to listen here from the parking lots. Well, Nissan Stadium officials say that impacts safety for those getting in and out of the concert. So again, they ask if you're not a ticket holder, don't congregate here at the stadium. Live in Nashville this evening, I'm Lydia Fielder, WSNB4. Lydia, thank you so much for that insight.